Hey guys, Jason Orban here with JHL Smart Reviews. I'm really excited to show you some of the new and exciting updates that we have for our review and referral system. Now, this is a system that we use with Go High Level. We've got about 180 agencies, I think, using it with thousands of locations that are using this review system for their clients and customers. And what I'm going to show you today is how we use it, how you can use it to A, get reviews, then maximize that engagement to get more referrals for your customers and clients. We have a couple different options. We have a gating version, a non-gating version, and a partial gating version that you can use depending on what your stance is with review gating your customers. And this is a great system, A, to be able to maximize the money that you can you can offer your clients or you can you can sell to your clients to give them more five star reviews you can generate more revenue for your agency you can offer it as a value add inside your agency so if you already have customers and you want to give them more value you can actually use this system to do that or if you want a great foot in the door offer to set customers up and get working with them, uh, maybe customers that you're not working with yet and you wanna approach them with something saying, hey, we can get you more five-star reviews um, automatically. This is something that you can use for that as well. So let me run you through the system. We've got a ton of stuff to cover over in a, in a couple minutes here because there's a lot of little features inside the system that make it really, really great. So first off, I'm gonna show you the review gating version here. This is the original version that we built. And I know there's a lot of controversy around uh, review gating these days, and I'm just gonna show you how our system works for this, and then I'll run you through the other two systems as well. So this first system here is, if they click anything less than three stars, it's gonna pop up this form and ask the customers for feedback. Now we're not completely review gating here. We're still giving the option to leave a review or a review here, even if it's gonna be a negative one, okay? We're not completely stopping them from leaving a review, but most of the time customers are just gonna fill out this form if they have a negative experience. If they're gonna go four or five stars, we're giving you the option to to do more than just Google that is native and high level. Um, we're giving the option to do up to, I think it's six different sites if you really, really want to get reviews for those different sites. But we really recommend only doing a maximum of three, you know, Google, Facebook, or any kind of uh, specialty site that you have, like my, might be Zillow or something like that. Um, you can have that pop up. Now, after that pops up, you're gonna see these two options come here. You're gonna click on one, and that's gonna send the customer over to uh, Google, for example. But what it's also gonna do, it's gonna refresh this page in the back end, which is really unique for our system. And it's gonna refresh this page and bring them to a page that they can then use to send out a referral to their friends or they can use it to post that offer that you have on social media. So it's sharing it out to friends. It's also sharing, it's also, if they wanna send out an email, it's gonna send out an email directly to those customers. It's gonna send out a text message as well. Now this is gonna enter them into different workflows and I can show you this over here. We have 20, over 20 workflows inside of our Smart Review system to handle different scenarios. So one of the things I'm gonna show you here in a second is our timed gating review uh, workflow. And how that works is we're simply just gonna start off by asking our customers for how their experience was. So feedback on how was your experience? Did you have a good experience or did you have a bad experience? How we set this up was if they gave, if they gave a positive reply, it's gonna send them down one path. If they give a negative reply, it's gonna send them down another path. Now, if they give a, a positive reply, reply or they click the positive trigger link inside the SMS or text or email message, it's either gonna enter them into the good experience or the negative experience. If they go to the good experience, then it's gonna enter them into the review funnel. It's gonna ask them for reviews. First, it's gonna tag them. It's gonna say, thank you for your experience. But here's the great part is now you can set it. So either it's not gonna send it immediately. You can wait one days, two days, three days, four days, five days, whatever you want before you actually ask those customers for a review. So if they're gonna give you a positive experience and say, hey, yeah, we had a great time. You're like, cool, thanks for your feedback. Now wait for one day, wait for two days, send them out another message later on asking them if they can leave a review. You're segmenting those customers rather than just blocking them right at that original spot. And what's that? what that's going to do is once they're done that, let me just see if I have this already open. Yeah, it's gonna send them over to the reviews and ranking no gating page. So this is the same thing as our original five stars, except 
There's no gating on this. So if they click one, two, three, four, five stars, it doesn't matter. It's going to send them over to Google or Facebook to give that review. Now we also have the leave feedback here so that they can just leave feedback if they like. This is also the other option for the, the, the first landing page that you can send customers to for review gating. If you don't want to do gating at all, what I would recommend is you can send the customer um, the review request uh, right to this page. This is going to be the first page that you set them up. It'll be step one. Um, I'll show you how to do that inside of all the training that we have for this system. I think we've got over 30 videos on how to do everything inside the system. There's so many configurations that you can set up. Um, <laughs> it's pretty awesome. So again, like I said, our whole our whole idea behind this was ask, after we asked them for review, how do we maximize that engagement, get them to do something else inside of high level, right? And the idea behind that was like, let's get them to give rever referrals, right? They already like us, they're already happy. Let's see if there's anybody that they can recommend to us. So we have this whole entire here referral workflow um, inside of our system. We also have this hold 180 days here. Now, I got a lot of questions about that. And, and, the answer, and the answer to what that is, is this here holds that customer's, uh, holds a tag on the customer and says, we're not going to ask them for review again for 180 days. That way we're not accidentally asking them multiple times within a month, two months, three months for another review. Uh, we're actually waiting six months before the option opens up to be able to put that person through the workflow again. We have some agencies that we work with who have set this over 180 days to 365 days. I've had some say, we're not gonna ask them again for two years. That's entirely up to you and the client. I mean, there's a ton of configuration that you can do in here. Um, we also have opportunities um, in the pipeline, you're going to be able to see where every client uh, review and referral request has gone in the pipeline. And as they go through the system, it's going to move them down this pipeline so you can see exactly where customers are at. Um, and then we have, I'm going to jump back over to here and inside our referral system here, we also have a referral dashboard. So you have the option inside the system of either saying, Hey, I just want to do reviews or I just want to do referrals or I want to do both. It's completely separated. It's really simple to, to just offer one or the other. Um, and we've also built this really cool client referral dashboard where they can come and see any kind of points that they've generated for the referral leads that they've referred. They also get their own referral link that they can use to share out with their friends and customer or friends and family. Um, and they also get this QR code that they can then use to um, have somebody just scan in. It's going to send them to your referral page. So let me click on this here. This is the referral page. They can actually bookmark this page on their smartphone um, and pull this up anytime that they want to do a referral to your business or your client's business. So it makes it super handy and super simple. Uh, an example of this is let's say a lady is out and she has a great haircut. People are saying, wow, I love your hair. That looks so awesome. How can we, uh, how can I get that? Or who do I talk to? She can pull this up on her phone, click a button, show that someone can scan that QR code, or she can just send the person an email right here. It's going to put them into the system. And now that that new referral is going to be a contact in there and they're going to get potential points for that person coming through. So uh, really system, we've thought about how do we make this as easy to use for everyone, um, including the clients. Um, on that note, let me show you this really cool system that we built. Uh, with GR GHL Smart Reviews, you're going to get access to our GHL Smart Scripts backend. Um, we have a bunch of different apps back here. These ones are all paid. Um, they're separate from the reviews and referrals system. You click on reviews and referrals. Um, we built this custom values updater that makes it super simple to be able to update any custom values inside of GHL Smart Reviews. So you don't have to guess at what each one is or what you have to do to make this actually work. Um, you can upload photos, upload files, um, everything like that. You can set all, everything in here is customizable. You don't even have to actually, to get this system up and running, you don't have to do anything on the, the reviews page. Um, you don't have to do anything with the templates unless you want to change some of the colors out of the box. It's ready to go. You just have to jump into our custom values updater here and fill in the blanks and your system is rocking and rolling. One other cool thing that I'm going to show you is how we, how you actually get customers into this system. Once, uh, you know, once you get your contact list in here, uh, once you get somebody signed up, 
We've got two ways to make it super simple for customers to actually upload their contacts. Now we've got this bulk custom values updater or, or custom C, no, not custom values, CSV file uploader. So the customer can come here, they can, they can bookmark this page uh, in their browser at work, wherever it is, export out an Excel file. They don't have to go into high level. They can select their Excel file from here. They can upload it and it's going to do the parsing and everything here. They're going to be able to map their fields for name, phone number, email address, that kind of stuff uploaded. It's automatically going to send those customers into high level and then it's going to add them to the review step one workflow. Okay. The other option in here is they can do it single, uh, I'm going to say single file one by one. They can upload customers here one by one through this form, or they can do a referral request the exact same way one by one this way here too. So a bunch of different op options. This is a super robust system. We've been doing it for over a year now, have a ton of happy agencies using this system. Uh, and I think if you try it out, you're going to love it too. So if you have any questions, comments, feedback, anything like that, you'd like to learn more or how you can get this rolling inside of your agency, hit me up, give me a shout. Um, you can find me on messenger here, just send me a message and I'm happy to respond to any questions that come along. And I'm happy to, uh, do whatever we can to help you get into the system. Uh, on that note, if there's anything you're thinking of saying, hey, this would be really cool to add this kind of feature to a system like this, or this is how I think we could use it, hit me up, man. I'm very flexible in that. And that is how 60% of the system has been built from agencies saying, you know what, this would be cool if we added this feature. It'd be really awesome if we added that feature. You know, if we could do this, this would be make, make it even more cool. So super open and I'm um, happy to chat with you about your agency and your business and see what we can do to get you doing more five-star reviews for your customers and clients. All right, we'll talk to you soon. If you have any questions, hit me up. Thanks, bye.